Okay, I came downstairs and I really want to show you guys something very exciting. This is my dad's chalent. And I never get to show you what chalents look like because I eat them on Shabbos. Like you put them up before Shabbos and it cooks on Shabbos and we eat it. But this one's for the cookbook. We're going to zhuzh it up. The potatoes are looking a little, um, I don't know. I don't know. What they, they need to be a little glossier for the photo. But I made it in this beautiful Dutch oven here. This is how my dad likes to do it versus doing it in a slow cooker. I'm giving both options in the book. But let's just do that again. Oh, I cannot wait to photograph this. Like how we're going to make Chalit look glorious and beautiful. That is where my food stylist comes in. And I know she's going to do an amazing job because this already looks good. In the cookbook, I'm going to have tons of information about Chalit, what it is. It's a Jewish stew. And there's a lot of really cool history to it, especially how it was made low and slow on Shabbos in the baker's oven back in the day and how we make it now. Oh my gosh. I cannot wait for you guys to make this. Yes, this is a Jewish stew, but anyone can make chalent. It's delicious.